set. Starters happy, green light, they're racing. And Sally Fletcher bounced out okay with Try Dreaming. And they go together in the early stages with Mary's Little Rose trying to tuck uh, just into the uh, one wide line there as Sally Fletcher presses forward. Now out deep on the track there was Regal Barra and the next one on the inside is Wonder Ranger Maz followed by Stonebridge Royal and settling at the tail of the field is Deadly Merriwood. So in that order they come into the home straight now with two to go a mile left to run. And the favourite Sally Fletcher now assumes control and leads the length on Try Dream and Regal Barra. Towers had a look around and see Stonebridge Royal striding up and now out wide. Deadly Merriwood is pressing forward as well. They will follow just in behind those. Wonder Ranger, Mary's Little Rose and all those shuffle ups leave Maz at the tail of the field. Lead time was 37.6 as they work into the back straight and it's Sally Fletcher the leader. A length clear on Tri Dreamin. Stonebridge Royal and now up on the outside taking closer order is Deadly Merriwood and pretty soon it'll find itself in the breeze. Next on the inside is Wonder Ranger, followed the outside by Regal Barra. A length to Mary's Little Rose and still last of all is Maz about six off the leader. 1,200 metres left to go. First quarter of the last mile is 30.6 and Sally Fletcher the leader. Only about a neck or a head in front, getting a little closer to it again as Deadly Merriwood second parked. Third on the inside is Tri Dreamin' from Stonebridge Royal and the next pair were Wonder Ranger racing on the inside of Regal Barra. A length away then to Mary's Little Rose and still last of all is Maz as they come into the straight to get the bell. And the leader is the favourite Sally Fletcher. Takes them down the lane by leading by three parts. Second on the outside as Deadly Merriwood shaken up. Third Tri Dreamin' fourth Stonebridge Royal. Regal Barra is next followed by Wonder Ranger Mary's Little Rose and still last of all is Maz and is about to start a searching run from the tail of the field. The second split was 29.6, 60.2 the half. Sally Fletcher, Sally's about to get rolling, leads the way by a length on a loose rein. Deadly Merriwood second, tried dream and moved up inside of it to under a clear second. Then Stonebridge Royal followed by Wonder Ranger, Regal Barra, Mary's Little Rose and Maz. They run inside the 400 metres. Third split was 28.8. Sally Fletcher led. Try Dream and won't go away. Sits hard on its back for the moment. And they're three in front of Stonebridge Royal, followed then by Regal Barra. But now Gavin says go. And Sally Fletcher, the race favourite, extends. Swings around the final bend and opens up three. Four in front now. She's dashed away. If you're on Sally Fletcher, queue up, you're home. It's going to come down and score a very easy win. Sally Fletcher in the first by five. Tried Dream in second. The Boulder Stonebridge Royal third. And fourth, Maz at the wire. Just collaring Regal Barra. And then a gap off to Mary's Little Rose. Deadly Merrywood. Last was Wonder Ranger. Last quarter, 29-1. And Sally Fletcher's mile rate, 158. That's how you like to see $1.30, $1.40 pops win. Has absolutely bolted in in the first. Sally Fletcher. Sally Fletcher. Baymare 4 by American Ideal out of I'm Off Limits. Owned by a group of owners, a large group of owners. Unfortunately, one of them I can see is cut off in the race book, but those that are there are L. Fitzpatrick, S. Wilson, J. Usher, A. Park, S. Tomassian. And there's another few owners as well. They, of course, raced Kate Ritchie some time back and they've kept the home and away theme, if you like, with uh, Sally Fletcher. And she has absolutely spaced them. 26.4 metres by 5.4, 235.8 the overall, 158 the rate. Quarters 30 and 6, 29, 6, 28, 8 and 29, 2. Gavin and Paul Fitzpatrick combined with this Baymare 4 by American Ideal out of I'm Off Limits. It's officially 2 1, 10 and 8, grab the fourth, Maz. 2, 1, 10 and 8, after the running of the first, for which I'll send the all clear down the line. And in around, I think it's 10 minutes or so, we're going to be catching up with Hazy from Harness Racing New South Wales and have a chat about all news harness racing. Thanks, Paul. Well, the place getters are coming back, and here's the winner, Sally Fletcher. She's got in by 26.4. Gav could have probably made it 36.4 if he wanted, because he sat up on her in the last little bit, and she cruised down to the wire to win it. She's uh, been knocking on the door with some good Menangle performances of late, and has been able to come here tonight and uh, bolt in in 158. The one has run second, sat on the back, and uh, has just plugged away for second held its ground well the 10's done a good job to run third and eight has come from the back to grab fourth chairman of stewards tonight is mr todd clark and he now gives all clear 
There's the result confirmed, 2-1, 10 and 8. It's all clear right to pay. Race two tonight, number six is going further back. She's in flight in the race at 6.49.